a quick overview of how to get nested portlets to work in the Ultranet. As you can see, I have already created a range of portlets on this page, publication displays, message boards, web form, and I've inserted a nested portlet at the top of the page. I have minimised all the portlets because they're easier to nest when they're minimised. In the nested portlet, I've used the configure button to create a two column layout with a skinny column on the left and a fat column on the right. I've set the page layout to one wide column because I want the portlet to create the clean background later on. Now it says to drag and drop the nested portlets, which is exactly what you do, but it's not simple. When you drag one up, you will notice that the nested portlet displays two grey columns, a skinny one on the left and a, a fatter one on the right. Now, when you actually get the portlet into the spot that it's supposed to drop, it should turn a highlighted apricot colour. Now I've gone down and up to make it. Now I can tell you straight away that that will not drop in there. You have to come across from the left or right. You have to go slowly across the divider till they both turn grey and then just slide slightly across further and then let go. And that one went in quite simply. Now we'll try another one going from the left to the right. We start on one side, drag slowly across. It's not going to work because the first column didn't go highlighted. So as I go across I can see it's not working. I'll go down, up, down. Now I've got a highlighted cell. I need to go slowly across from left to right again. When I get to the middle it starts jumping around. When it jumps around it's very hard to have success. Usually when you drop it, the portlet goes outside of the nested portlet. So I'm going to go and try and go very slowly across, still jumping around an awful lot. It's gone double grey. If I slide slightly further to the right and let go, it should go in, but it didn't. So we'll try that one more time. Going from the left to the right is hard because once there's a portlet in there, it bounces around an awful lot. We'll try and go across that dividing space slowly and we'll get to the edge where they both go grey, slide across a bit further and let go and it didn't work again. So I'm going to try with the message board this time and I'm going to go from the left hand side across to the right hand side where the left hand side is empty and that will create a smoother drop. As we go across, they both turn grey, then let go and it drops in. I'm going to try this publication display again, going from the left-hand side. I've got it highlighted, get close to the join, went too fast. Go back and try again. As I go from the left-hand side, I need to go onto the line so that both sides of the portlet go grey, then slide across a little bit further without it jumping if I possibly can and try again go from the highlighted side oh and I let go on that side and it went in now we're going to try one more going from in it pops and the lucky last one sliding across both go grey about now and then let go on the left hand side try it again let go and it should drop in. If it's jumping a lot the chances of success are lower and let go and it'll be in. Now once they're all in you can go back and maximize each of the portlets at will. I will make a follow-up screencast to show you how to change all the backgrounds and get rid of the edit controls and make it look like it's one continuous portlet with um, the different bits displaying in it.